So our children are not here to fulfill our expectations. Our children are here to live out their life. And we are here as parents, as educators, to support them. Uh, we cannot guarantee that our children will be successful or whatever. Uh, in the end, it's their responsibility. But what we can do is uh, do our best to support them to develop in a harmonious way as uh, full human beings. I think it's very important also not to let uh, social expectations uh, be too much uh, of a burden on us. Uh, maybe we're expected uh, to be rich, to be very successful, to be have a high social position and so on and so forth. In the end, what really makes a difference is whether we have a happy life. Then all these outer, you know, uh, outer success, social position, uh, fame and whatever, this will all pass. But uh, our own sense of um, being a good human being, having done the best we could in our life, uh, being kind with the people uh, we are with, uh, contributing in a meaningful way to society, uh, these kind of values are more important than like outer social expectations. So we should not let outer social expectation dictate uh, what we do and how we behave and really more found in ourselves, in our own values, in our own is meaningful for us. What brings us happiness? What brings happiness to our loved ones? These should be our guiding uh, stars, if you want. Okay. You know, uh, trying to not to be too conformist, not to, you know, obey too much to social expectation and rather more looking inward and uh, looking also what our children really want, uh, you know, uh, and each child is different, accepting the difference and supporting their difference. And uh, I think uh, that can be very helpful to lift this burden of feeling, oh, we have to achieve this, we have to achieve that. That's a burden for the kids, that's a burden for the parents, and be a bit lighter about it, knowing that in the end, what really matters in life is to be happy.